Greetings, and this is my second vlog. I'm still in the space where I'm not feeling up to kind of sitting down and writing. It also means that while I vlog, I can actually fuss the dog. So there's Ozzy. Oh no, Ozzy. Uh, whereas when I'm writing, I'm kind of shushing him away, pushing him away. So this is my monthly kind of weight loss update blog. At the start of the year, I made a resolution to lose weight. It's a resolution I've made every year for, for a while. And... Um, one of the other resolutions was that I'd update monthly. It's kind of a way to hold myself accountable. Uh, I can't hide how badly I've done. I can't shy away from if I'm not really putting the effort in. There's my far hand in the shot there uh, while I switch hands. It really knackers your hand holding your phone like this. I'm going to have to get like a stand or something. Um, back to the point. So September, going into September, I was quietly confident that this would be a good month weight loss wise. Uh, August had been good. I'd lost like three pounds. Um, way under like the overly optimistic target of half a stone a month I'd had at the start of the year. But I, that was a pipe dream. But um, I did really well in August. I was on night shift, so I was kind of surprised. And then I was back in September. I was running. I had Paris coming up. I was really trying to avoid snacking too much. Uh, my, my relationship with food is kind of problematic in that I will treat myself after a bad day you know and it's always with something unhealthy um you know it's it's just stupid really it's counterproductive because then i feel like shit because i've eaten badly so it's kind of a vicious circle so i did try to do better there were a few indulgences a few treats along the way uh in paris you know we had snacks we had coffees i was having more lattes and stuff and i've been really trying to cut back on that but the running i think has been going well. I was kind of not in my headspace before Paris. Paris went really well. Uh, my fat hand in shot again there. Um, and yeah, and today I've been for a run. So I've kind of fallen back in love with running. Uh, part of the reason I like, I think that is, is I've got to that stage where I'm not watching the clock. I'm not listening to the, you've got to w run this amount of time, walk this amount of time. You know, you're watching the clock. I'm now kind of running for the state of, I want to run. I want to get out there. I've got a couple of challenges on the go. I'll probably blog, vlog or blog about that later. So, yeah, it's the running's going well. Went out today, did 5K, felt great, felt really pumped afterwards. So, that's good. So, hopefully, that'll counteract September, which was kind of a, a real annoying month, because I thought I'd done well, but I hadn't. Uh, I'd actually lost most of the weight. I uh, put back on most of the weight I lost in August. So the last two months, it's like a slight loss, which makes it feel like a waste of time. The problem is, is there's no one to blame but me. Um, I need to be more sensible. I need to focus on exercise. I need to stop kind of taking easy options with regards to food. Um, and I've just really got to be more sensible. Um, so I'll be probably be back doing another one of these at the end of October. Um, I'd like to lose a bit more in the uh, before before the end of the year. Uh, I can't actually remember how much I've lost this year so far. I know I'm down on where I was in January, but how how much how much how how much I've gone down? I kind of lost that thread then. So. I'm guessing in about 30-ish days I'll be making another one of these. I'll probably blog about the running challenges I've taken up. Um, I kind of feel that this these vlogs are kind of all about that at the moment. There will be other stuff. I am going to talk about different things. But at the moment, you know, this is kind of one of the things I've got going on and something that I'm thinking about a lot. I really want to keep going with the running. I want to do a 10K next year. So I've really got to get fitter. Um, and weight loss would help with that. And also, I think when I'm being healthier, when I'm running, when I'm doing those challenges, it started last year when I was doing this, the Country File Ramble, which is coming up again this year. I'm not doing it this year because I've already asked everyone to sponsor me for two things. I kind of think going for three would be pushing my luck. You know, people have been more than generous. You can still sponsor me for the 5K I did back in Paris. Um, that would be great. We have passed over a thousand now, which is fantastic. Uh, the address for that, I'll stick it in the bottom uh, or on top, wherever you're watching this. So thanks. Um, that's all I'm going to say now. Uh, it's been an, an annoying month in terms of weight loss. Uh, I feel better mentally, which I think is more important in a way. Uh, 
I feel more comfortable with the running. Uh, I'm enjoying it more. So kind of, I kind of think as annoying as it is that I haven't lost that weight uh, that I put some back on mentally and emotionally and where I am in a lot of other ways is good, which is kind of my always been my thing that I don't want to lose weight because I think I'm going to lose weight. I'm suddenly going to love life. I'm going to love myself more. I'm going to be happy. I'm a pretty happy guy most of the time anyway. I think the weight loss is something I want to work on, but it's not the be-all and end-all. I'm not judging my success this year, apart from on that resolution, uh, as whether I've lost weight or not. So September, emotionally great, lots of fun, did a lot of cool stuff, um, you know, the the Paris thing, I started writing again, um, you know, not being as, as kind of low as I was in, in July, so all that's good, weight loss could do better, so hopefully October, the mental health stuff, the feeling good, the enjoying my running will continue, but maybe hopefully I can avoid a bit of those temptations, I can kind of take a pause and think, Chris, do you really need to treat yourself, do you deserve that treat, is it going to make you feel better after a bad day and to make some healthier choices? So I'll be back in a month uh, to see how it goes. Thanks for watching. This has gone a bit longer than I planned. Apologies for rambling. Uh, I'll, I'll talk to you guys soon. Uh, be excellent to each other. Bye-bye.